Hey, bud. Hey. Hey. So flea season is approaching. And Boldy here is most susceptible to the fleas. They love to cohabitate on him. Tasha, come here. Natasha here seems to be the most resistant to please. And Kit Kat is pretty susceptible to the fleas as well. The fleas tend to go from Voldy to Kit Kat back to Voldy regularly. And it's not fun when you have to itch all the time. Yeah. So to combat the fleas, I got Ceresto flea collars. I got them for like $57 a piece. To save a couple of bucks, I only bought flea collars for the small dogs. It helps that if I can keep them off the small dogs, Tasha doesn't even need to wear a flea collar. Them up. We've got the collar, the instructions. So former clips and a calendar sticker. We bought these Ceresto collars at the advice of the veterinarian at the vaccine clinic that we went to. And in the instructions, it says, Bayer polymer matrix ensures that both active ingredients are continuously released in low concentrations. These clips are sort of like reflectors and they lock onto the collar. So let's open the collar. And the directions say to take off these little connectors that kept the collar wrapped in the wrapper. and I made it tight enough that he can't get it off and loose enough that I can put two fingers through. And we'll see how it works. Let's open a second one. Second collar on Kit Kat. You're exempt, Tosh, for the time being. Bye. Yeah, and so far, they don't care. So, so far, I really like your Ceresto flea collar. It's been six weeks since I put it on you. And you're still clear of fleas. You got a haircut and a bath. And I didn't see anything. Yay! Bye.